Hello, and welcome to my tutorial series on how to make a collective card game in Unity. In this video, I just wanted to take a couple minutes to better explain the list and how it works, because I didn't think I did a good job of doing that in the prior video. Let's get started. A list is a dynamically sized array, meaning we don't need to know how many elements it's going to have ahead of time. We need a class to store in our list. Right here is a class called card, and it's very similar to the one we created in our game. Some of the names that are being given to these variables are different than the one in your game because this is a different project I'm using as an example. Right down here is a constructor for our variables. This is very similar to what we've already done and how we allocated these variables. Now let's create our list. Let's go over here to this card database script. In here, we created our list. In order to create a list, we need to make sure we put in using system.collections.generic. To call the list, we need to type the word list. And inside here is our data type, which in this case is the class card we created. This can be any type of data type though for any list you will make. It could be an int or a string. Right here is the name of our list. We call it card list. And we set it equal to the new list we're gonna create of our data type. Now let's add items to our list. We are doing that down here. We are calling the name of our list right here, card list. We're using this add function. And over here is the constructor we are using. If you see how I mouse over, it says card.card, .card, and then it has all this information right here. This is the class, this is the constructor, and this is the information that's getting applied to it. That is all similar to this right here. Here's our class, here's our constructor, and this is all the information that's getting applied to it int ID, a string called card name, an int for cost, and an int for power. That's all the same right here, and these are the new uh, pieces of information that we are applying to it. Zero is the ID, this card has no name, it has zero for mana, and it has zero for power. The next one, the ID is one, the name of the card will be elf, the mana is two, and the power is 1000. So that's it for today. As always, thank you for watching. Like this video, subscribe to my channel, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, and support me on Patreon. All links are in the description below. See you next time.